Welcome to Minding Your Business on News Talk 1380, the Antelope Valley and North LA County source for your news now. This is the Lancaster Chamber of Commerce Minding Your Business weekly radio show, and I'm Chris Spiker from Antelope Valley Florist, your host. And guess what? This week we have a co host, Aaron Goldstein. Welcome. Thank you. Hey, and so last week you were. You were the tech guy, the video guy, and now you're a co-host. Yes, now, now I get to, you know, think of things on the spot and probably make a fool of myself, but we're going to make it work. <laughs> well, the nice thing is you, you're, not on, you're not on camera, so if uh, all they will hear is your voice, how's that? And you're going to be introducing our first uh, guest today, our first ch chamber member. Who is our first guest? Well, today we have Paul Wagner, AV Webmaster. Paul, welcome. Thank you. Thank Aaron. you very much. Thank you, Aaron. And this is right in your field, AV Webmaster. So if you've got a question, uh, chime in, okay? Mm -hmm. Paul, how long have you been a chamber member? I have been a chamber member now for about mm, five years, I think. And you attend a lot of things. Yes, I do. I believe in service. Service to community is important. I think we all need to do more of that. You do a lot. Well, you know, because it's fun, isn't it? Yeah. And you meet people. Oh, yeah. And so tell me a little bit about what AV Webmaster does. AV Webmaster is a full source web developer and hosting um, programs that we offer. Okay? As a designer, it is my goal to help you make web designs that are going to be engaging and drive traffic and I'll be talking a little bit about that. Other things that we do is we do search engine optimization and search engine marketing. SEO. Yep, absolutely. And videos, we are building video intros and optimizing them on YouTube for your website, which is very engaging and very SEO friendly. Uh, we are now doing web mobile applications development and uh, now, also new, Periscope training. You were talking to me about Periscope. Periscope's amazing. Hold on now, we'll get to okay, there. Okay, okay. It's good stuff. Now, with regard to your website, many people think that once you have a website, it's good to go and you don't need to look at it ever again. <laughs> and that is so far from the truth. You have to, what's called, curate it. Keep it going. Add blogs for SEO. Add videos for SEO add um, new content. Google loves fresh content. And you also have to make it mobile friendly because what that means is if you go to your website and they can't see it on your phone, Google will literally degrade you on the search engines for mobile. So you disappear? Yes. Wow. When you're looking for a website phrase that you want to find, say, Dentist Lancaster, Okay, if it's not mobile friendly, then you won't come up at all. Wow. Yeah. It's, Ouch. It really is. It's huge. Um, so all my websites are mobile friendly. Yeah. I have to. You have to do that. Uh, when you're developing, when I'm developing your website, I'm very much asking a lot of questions along the way. I have to, I have to get my head around your business. Uh, I'm proud to say I'm a very good uh, artist and that helps me organize the layout that's going to make your website intriguing, attractive, engaging. Um, so there's two aspects to all websites, traffic and conversion. Traffic is driving those people that are using those keywords to find you, Dentist Lancaster, to your web page via Google search. Now. On Google search, you can reach to the top fairly easily these days if you know what you're doing. Fortunately, I know what I'm doing. Well, yeah, you're making a living at it. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. You have to do good there. So traffic is driving the people to your website. But once they get there, they, have to, they, they will only stay between one and three seconds before they make the decision to stay and explore more or leave. Oh, Lord, what a shotgun blast. I am out so out of here. Yeah, never again. Nope. Yeah, and, yeah, and that's the truth. They, they, they won't come back. So you've got to engage them right out of the chute and make them stay. 
I like people that are going to come to my website and say, hey, Martha, come here, look at this. Isn't this the <laughs> best website you have ever seen? Yeah. That's yeah. the goal. Yeah. I, I want them to, to, to get hooked into it. So I'm going to pop up on a video and say, hey. Yeah. Okay, now I got them for a second. That's right. Now, now they have to say, oh, what are the, look, look, at, at, look at this. Look at that. Where, what is that all about? Okay, now I got them for five seconds. Those were, yeah, those are what sidebars are all about, too. Sidebars are very important in any website. All right, because they help intrigue. They're not tantamount to the, to the flow, the main flow, the main concept, but they're enough to go, oh, look, there's more about this. That looks engaging. And, of course, if you're in a, 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 a mortar and brick building, yep. you want maps so that they show up first on your mobile device. That's very important, you know. Uh, one of my sites is a veterinarian. So she wants that, you know, her traffic to be go, be able to say, we're bringing our dog in, it's an emergency, oh, where are they? Right. Bring it up, bring her website up, yep. click, there she is. Yep. All right, that's very important. So, now search engine optimization is also very important in all of this. Uh, before I begin any website, we start with the keywords analysis. I include that in my quotes. They're very important because if you don't use the correct keyword phrases, people may come, but they're not going to see what they were after. And those are all the volumes and other tools that I use. Now, you may know more about keywords than, than your client. Uh, the client I, may not know what is going to be searched. For. Which we work together. Right. Good question because we will do that search together. I will literally bring them in in a remote session. And we will go through all the keywords that are relevant, filter out those that are irrelevant, filter out those that, oh, I would have never thought of that. Right. Okay, that's right. no good, but it'll still come in. And that's what search engine, uh, things like um, pay-per-click is all about, where people can pay to come up in the ads on a Google search, and you say, oh, yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I'll click there. Right. People will pay for that. Uh, sometimes a lot of money. Insurance companies will pay $55 for a click, which is crazy. That's an awesome client. <laughs> but they spend an enormous amount, too, just to get that list. Yeah. I will help you build your list. That's very important. Okay. Who is visiting you? We call that opt-in. You offer something to them in exchange for their name and email. Yeah. That's called an opt-in, and every site should have it, you know, if that's if you're willing to collect your uh, data, if you want to collect your clients and prospects, because then you can remarket back to your prospects. Right. That's, that's how you get them in the loop. These are lookers. The, yes, exactly. Now, another thing that I'm working on are video intros. These are really cool because right now, Google is looking at videos almost more than anything in order to drive traffic. I mean, uh, probably all of us have gone in and done a Google search, and then at the very top are a couple of Google videos, YouTube right. videos. Yep. And Google owns YouTube, so they favor that. And it's not difficult to come up with almost all kinds of videos that are, uh, we put tags on and keyword phrases on the videos. Yep. Uh, and that helps them um, take that information and build people that are coming in. Powerful. Very powerful. Uh, and getting more so every year now. 2016 is going to be an enormous year for YouTube videos. I've seen where people can make videos on their phones. Oh, yeah. Right and, and, and then you just move it right up to YouTube. Simple. And then you go, you know, uh, to put in your, your tags. And all of a sudden, you'll find. I know some guys are getting um, new hits every day because of just their YouTube videos. Yep. Now, I'm also doing mobile apps that an app, your website, even though it could be mobile friendly, should also be have a mobile app because it's just so easy to push a button and be in any number of these. Your website, social wall, live chat, Facebook, Twitter, a bookshelf if you offer books or you have you wrote your own book, and a calendar, 
and of course e-commerce to sell things. That's all available from one that um, one button that they will download from you um, um, from uh, iTunes. So Paul, you're almost besides a doer, you're you're almost a consultant. Yeah. So somebody could call you and start asking questions. That's I that's guess right. That's where it begins. We all have our our top core values. And I have decided in 2015 that mine are technology, creativity, and service. Those are very powerful. And finally, personal uh, Periscope training. Periscope training is an app that owned, owned by Twitter, and it's live video streaming. Now, for you, that's perfect. In for, the flower business? In the flower business. Going around Today, the we're going to show you how to do an, an, an arrangement. You should have seen the stargazers I was working with this morning. That would have made a great video. Really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Fragrant. We need smell -o vision When's that going to happen? <laughs> not, probably not my lifetime. we got just one minute. So how do people find you, Paul? All right. I'm on various places on the websites. avwebmaster.com. That's the simplest one. I also have expertwebdesign.us. That's another place that you can find me. And I just bought, found the domain, which I was blown away that was available, that I bought, laperiscope.com. Wow. Somebody was sleeping. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So that's my business. Yeah. You might resell that here in a couple of years. LA no Periscope. way. I'm going to be making too much money on it. <laughs> Paul Wagner, AV Webmaster, thanks for being a chamber member. Thank you. You bet. Very good, Chris. Thank you. You bet.